enlisted i talked about it yesterday um and we're back playing some more but basically you have all these on the left hand side these are different squads when you spawn you select one person in your squad and they all spawn with you so when i spawn typically i rank them from highest to lowest ranking soldier um so i spawn in as one of these guys and then the rest of them spawn in and they follow you but if you go down then you can press y i'm not sure what it is on controller but uh you swap to the next character and then you pretty much play through the entire squad until everybody's dead so even though there's only 10 people versus 10 people on each team it feels like there's 40 50 60 however many people you, there actually are um it's pretty cool to be honest it's been a lot of fun so far and it plays like a battlefield game in my opinion so that's been my experience with it so far i have been going back and forth today whether i would play this or divinity and i finally decided to play this because uh i wanted to play more so here we are um real quick before we get started though i'm just gonna check weapons and other things um so also the way it works unfortunately um it's by each team so right now my allies is level four for the invasion of normandy but there's also battle of moscow which has the allies and the uh the axis but the allies is russian axis still germans um but yeah it, it's really cool to be honest yeah i can definitely see that and as you can see right here uh this one's level one because i haven't played them yet but i'm going to continue leveling my allies um and i was going to check something else but <laughs> but yeah uh so with that i guess we can just like jump right into it right might as well might as well battle pass progress for the next completed task three stars do it <laughs> yeah they have battle pass they have premium um I did get 30 days of premium access so basically my people level up faster and things like that um but yeah you'll you'll see the game in just a, a minute or two here i'm honestly pretty surprised that how how well this game has ran so far for being as early uh early at stages it is in so three two one maps still going to be loading in for a minute or two but we are good so here i am and all these guys right here with the yellow or green above their head those are all my ai members and they will follow me in everything that i command them to to, to do So I'm actually going to swap to this guy, so that way, oh god, this game gets very loud as well, but I'm going to make a rally point. See, the really cool thing is combat is basically always ongoing 
because even when you die, you're not out for good. Because you still have the re remaining members of your squad. Which I still have two more people left. Boom. Luckily, there's no friendly fire, so it's actually pretty much impossible to shoot your team, but I'm pretty sure that was an enemy right there. Oh, maybe it wasn't. Are you serious? How many times? Jesus. How many times are that is gonna take a shot? <laughs> this looks like cuisine royale. What? Wait, we just took Charlie and now we lost it. Also, I'm the only one left in my squad right now. Jesus. Uh-oh. Oh no. Bad grenade placement. Are you serious? <laughs> Damn. Nice. The selected squad isn't active. Spawn will be available in two seconds. There we go. So basically the allies don't have anything over their head. Like, there's no marker. It can definitely be hard to tell the difference at time. Oh my god, dude. That was like a three second squad wipe. Jesus, dude. No, they're gonna destroy my thing. Oh my god. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, which is actually pretty funny. I was literally like, when I first started playing this, like yesterday, uh, or the date, yeah, no, I think it was yesterday. Um, I was thinking the same exact thing. Hold on, I'm gonna try using this guy to put down. Trying to put down a rally point somewhere. Get to it, man. We're 
Really? Damn. Where's the leadership in this godforsaken place? Yeah, so middle mouse button actually. Oh, shoot. Clear. But that was gonna be like a grenade for a second there. It's funny because you don't see any of your your teammates names too. Ah oh, damn we lost. So that's the first game of the day at least. Let's see anybody level up? Get reward. You got a new weapon card. Win one battle, kill 20 enemies using a pistol. Uh, get 40 kills using a semi-automatic weapon. Are all these semi? Right? Technically, yeah. Or are they bold action? Where does it say? I think that's, well, that's technically semi, if I think, if, I mean, that's the way that I'm thinking of it, at least. Um. Let me give this guy the Lee Enfield. give him a grenade Yeah, I mean, right now it's still in beta. I think it would be a really cool if it had better graphics too. But for where it's at, it's not too bad, you know. Definitely can get better, and hopefully it does, but we'll see. War Thunder, I think, is even pretty good too, in my opinion. So I'm, I'm really confused how this works. Because I've seen some people, like, all the way, like pretty far into this and these are all free so I'm like confused how exactly it works who has pistols for me okay let's jump into the next game I need more pistol kills I'm actually I'm gonna try to actually get that I don't think it actually tells you what guns are semi-automatic. Firing modes manual. I don't know what the game considered semi-automatic. Wow, I'm just now realizing that if you move the mouse, it moves the thing like this. I like the look of the town, but the character models could use an upgrade. Yeah, they're a little weird, but not too bad. I don't know what they changed, but it's running. I, at least it feels like it's running different than it did yesterday. 
I'm gonna actually try to get kills with the pistol. What? I'm gonna try it. This is probably a horrible area to place this down, but hey, we'll give it a shot. Some of them, <laughs> they say some funny stuff. Like the cheers and stuff too are are, uh, are interesting, but it's cool. <laughs> are you kidding me? Uh, so I can't figure out, I need to watch something or like a video or I don't know what I need to do, but I, I want to learn how to fly in this game. Cause I feel like it would actually be kind of cool, but for some reason, it's so hard for me to figure out how to do, I know how to decline, but I don't know how to do the incline, um, like to go up. Basically, I feel like everything I try doing doesn't work. So it like confuses the hell on me. Get some. Let me be your co pilot. All right. Wow, my, my entire team died, or my squad died. Well, shit. I think I'm, yep, I'm dead. All right, let's try it. Ready, so watch. This is what I mean. All right, so I can go down, no problem, right? No issue. It's going up and also figuring out how to turn. Okay, I don't know if they changed something, but it feels smoother. Oh God, my guy's about to black out. All right, I think it's actually working a little better.
Control point Bravo. Dude, I can't, dude. I like, I like. I know what I'm trying to do, but I'm just not doing it. I don't know if it's like inverted or what. Like I, I know what I'm trying to do. Like I'm trying to go for down and then pull back up and then swing it around, but I just can't do it. I feel like everything I'm doing is it's doing the opposite. And I don't know if there's a way you can invert it. Like if I push forward, I want it to go down. And if I pull back, I want it to go up. But I think it is the opposite. Yeah, did that person get two shots? Do they have like a flight school training? Nah, they don't. At least I don't think so. Uh, maybe see it. Oh, let me check if there's like an invert. Um, something in here. Uh, doesn't look like it. I'm gonna try changing the game to full screen. Maybe other controls, main. than third per person? can do it like this. Invert X. X is left and right and Y is up and down, right? Let's try that. I didn't know that you could do that. <laughs> time. Uh, time to reinstall it. We have... Let's see. So if pulling back goes up. Yeah, I'm curious. Oh, give me a kill. No, nothing. No way, that thing that I put down is still here. Holy crap, dude. Somebody just got domed. <laughs> wow, they're actually... T 
Team player, MVP, nice. Somebody's here. This, I think this is the first time I, I've played two of the same matches. Uh, the same map. Every other time, it's been like different maps each time. Sounds like there's one up here. And no, that's me. That's the one that I put down, still. Oh god, I see it lagging. Let's try it. Let's try it. Okay, so we push down to go down. Push down the pull up kind of guy. <laughs> so now it's a little bit better because now when I pull back, it goes up, and when I push forward, it goes down. See? Just like that. So now, pull back. What the hell? Somebody just had like a, a killing spree of killing themselves. I think I hit the bottom of the thing. They have seven people instantly spawning right here. That's definitely another guy. Holy crap. Nice. Red tails. Oh my God. You mean like that old school movie? Um, like the cartoon movie thing. Damn. I had a good run there. <laughs> Victory. Nice. What was that? Where was I at on the leaderboard? I'm curious. I think I was second.
battle heroes. Bleh. Yep, second. Oof, they beat me by one kill. Oh, I'm thinking of the, the, um, what's that? There's a cartoon movie from back in the day that has like a similar name. It was literally called like something tales. I can't remember it off the top of my head right now. I give this guy the carbine back in my day yeah literally so many weapon orders get rewards here we go take reward Progress to the battle pass is limited to three pat tasks per day. Buy the premium pass to increase this to nine tasks per day. We got four kills. I'm gonna reset this one. I don't even have a flamethrower yet. Wait, when do I earn one that, or when do I unlock one? Better question. Flamethrower, level six. Okay, we're five. That might be doable. I just really want to get more people because right now I'm so... I I can't, like, get any new ones. This guy is not... Oh. Really? He's a submachine gun? He's not in a team right now. Oh no, he's right here. Jack Morgan, that's this guy. Do we have any upgrades? Oh, we do. Why isn't it telling me we have upgrades? Just want to be in infantry. There's plenty of infantry guys here at least. Squad upgrades. Um, we have five points available for this one. For troopers, or unlock backpack slots for them, or we can do. I really want to get the bat, the radio operator, which is level seven. Bomber is eight. Gunner is 11. I mean, it wouldn't be bad having a That's bomber right there. It sucks that you can only have a gunner or an assaulter. I might do one assaulter in this one. Yeah, let's do it. Unlock that just so that's done and over with. Do radio operator. That's like all we can do in this tree. Is 
How does it feel to be enlisted? <laughs> uh -huh. I see what you did there. Modification cost. Yeah, I'll take that. Uh, let's do this one now. So this is that group. Take another one of these. Yeah, let's take a sniper. We can throw one in this group. That'd be kind of cool. Personnel. Then, yeah, we'll throw a bomber in once we unlock them. Sidearm slot. We'll get that next time. This one is so bad for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do I? Do I? Oh, it does. I will say, I will have to disagree with you, Dev. Because it does have a lot. So, we're playing, we've played the same map twice, but there's about five different maps. And then, if you switch teams, then now you have entire new weapons, entire new people. And then, if you switch campaigns, you have entire new weapons, factions, and maps like I've only played these maps like uh, a few times and there's like five or six maps I haven't played the Battle of Moscow at all yet and there's like about the same so it's pretty impressive to be honest Oh wow, you get troops from that too? I didn't even know. Not gonna lie, I'm, I, I'm pretty excited about that though. And that aspect. M1 Carmine. I'll take one more of those. And then we have four. Four and four. Then we have four of these. I'm gonna hold off on that. And then let's go to this one. Oh, oh wait, we don't have a gold yet. That's okay. <laughs> Dog fighting I had on the Wii. That's funny. I think I might go sniper and assaulter. Oh my god, level 4. Level 3, that's not bad at all. Not bad at all. So then, what? you know what kind of sucks is... So, you can train. So this guy is a level 3, right? If I want to train him up, then uh, you have to sacrifice two other people to do so. So it kind of sucks because you're like stuck in a way I want an army of infantry how many days are left 70 days that's not bad sniper elite what is that kill 20 enemies with headshots in a single battle Uh, 
I'm going to give him this. He's my number one guy. Uh, so you need that M1 carbine. Wait, really? It's under the mechanics group? Or the engineer group? Maybe I should start leveling up my engineers then. I'm so bad at flying anyways, so I might as well go up to this. think to upgrade this yeah huh so you have to do in order to upgrade them the weapons you have to do them and they're each specific squad so this is leanne field upgrades and then m1s then this is uh m3 and the m3 a1s and this one is ross mark three Buddy I went to high school with he's a senior this year and he already has his pilot's license yeah you can get your pilot's license like pretty early on it's it's kind of surprising but it's it's cool too um you could be pretty young to be honest do I have another sniper somewhere I do. Are you here? Can I take one out? Wait, I have a separate sniper right here. I thought I unlocked the ability of having a sniper in one of these. Oh, it's this one. Three, three. Do it like that. And then in order to upgrade these, you have to use a sniper class. I see now. Look at this team right here. <laughs> Once I have more people, so when I can fill these slots, I can have one extra person in here, but I need another trooper in order to do so. So once I can fill all the slots, then I'll start training people. Because then I'll have an overrun, overran of the amount of people. <laughs> Imagine entrusting a 14 year old to fly your plane. After stream, uh, probably gonna watch a bunch of Operation Flashpoint videos. Those games were fun. They're on, um, one of them is on PC, I'm pretty sure. I wouldn't mind jumping into that one day. That's like pre Arma days for me. Before I got into Arma. I'm going to make sure everybody has like grenades or pollution. Axe. Guy doesn't have a med kit. Okay, we're out of grenades. The other th cool thing, too, is every time you level up, you basically get a new. Uh, 
regiment like this right here this lets you swap out your regiments and stuff six seven eight eleven twelve thirteen fourteen seventeen eighteen twenty twenty one twenty five All right, let's go back into the next one. I was so god awful leading my squad at an objective and flying a any helicopter. I love the feeling of the game; so different and gorgeous to look at. Yeah, I remember playing it on the Xbox back in the day. Um, that was like one of the games I remember seeing at like GameStop, and I was like, "Ooh, what is this?" And then you like start in the back of the van, and jump out. And then next thing you know, you're like storming an area, and then there was like a night, uh, night vision mode and stuff. It was really cool. <laughs> um, yeah, I love that. One day, I'm definitely going to. There's a game called. Um, uh, SWAT 4 where it's basically oh god there's a tank there it's basically a tactical shooter but there's a mod to it um, and it randomly generates the, the map each time but it has a story and basically each mission is like randomly generated and you have to try to like figure it out you're a SWAT team so you go in you infiltrate and then you can talk to your squad members the AI and be like okay stack up on that door breach flashbang and open <laughs> so uh, I want to I want to play that game someday. I, I've only played like an hour of it or so. Oh God. Damn. I'm gonna go to Bravo. Remember my first tape, dude. That's another game I want to replay. I want to replay the entire story of Rainbow Six One and uh, and to Rainbow Six Vegas. That would be so much fun. I love first-person shooter stories, like when they're tactical. It's a lot of fun. What happened to my sniper, dude? Oh my god, I actually hit the tank. Holy crap, dude. Ready? We're going in right behind them. Behind enemy lines. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Reload, reload. Damn. Whoops. Never played Siege. I only played two Rainbow. I believe it was. Yeah, that's why I meant Vegas. Did I say Siege? I meant Vegas. Well, yeah. Unless if you're just saying you never played Siege. I loved Vegas games though. I hope you can turn HUDs off in this game. Hate having bars and kill feeds. Yeah, you can. I'm pretty sure.
I'm gonna try going in with the sniper squad. Sniper squad. Yeah, there's a lot of see I don't like any of those like the only the only one that I don't mind for multiplayer is like battlefield and even that can be kind of bad sometimes like some of them just for, for whatever reason they get the the unfortunately a lot of times like the most Toxic people, you know Annoying like toxic people And that's honestly one of the reasons why I don't play, play siege I like playing siege, but I I typically only play it when I'm playing with friends Because I'd rather not deal with that Of Annoying people yelling at me for not knowing how to play. Dude, what? There's no way. How would that guy know every single time? I meant to swap to this guy again. Oh my god, they've almost won already? Holy crap. Dude, we got demolished this time. It honestly doesn't even matter, but it's whatever. There was this other um, really cool game that I found over the weekend though. It's called First Class Trouble. It's basically, imagine Among Us, but with a Fallout vibe to it. And then, um, it has a Fallout vibe to it. And then also, uh, Uh, Fallout vibe and I can't remember what else I was going to say now Fallout vibe it, it has uh, voice voice over IP so like you have to talk with your actual teammates like closely and then um there's actual objectives but the matches don't drag on forever and it's not like when you die that somebody can call a emergency meeting it's like when you die um you turn into like this little thing to uh interesting i haven't used one of these yet Uh, you turn into like this little robot thing and you can drive around the map. The enemies at control point Charlie. We've 
Town of Salem is a really cool game. There's another game that's like that has a similar thing to it, but it had like a, a pretty big revamp recently. Get it, get it. Ah, oh, damn. Well, I actually got a decent hit on it. Got it. Oh, this is the M1 carbine. Heal, heal, heal. You're gonna die a hero today, sir. Damn it. I always forget to select one of the map markers. There's, um... But uh, so after playing that this weekend and having like that Fallout vibe, it really made me want to play Fallout, which I, I promise sometime soon I'm going to do uh, Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas, Fallout 4 playthroughs, Skyrim, possibly Oblivion soon. I don't know when, but eventually I 100% I will. I, I miss those games so much. And it's like night and day playing it on PC compared to Xbox. It's not, yeah, they're, they're fun games to be honest. You always have to, it's so hard to judge their grenades. Oh my god. Control point Bravo has been lost. Damn. <laughs> Good for Alpha. That's right. They're good games. I I'm surprised. Is it just like the clunkiness of the game that you don't like? Or is there more to it? Like, do you not like the storytelling? Or like the atmosphere or anything. I feel like they would be like perfectly your game. Your style game at least. I could not get it, that shot off. The life of me. Oh my god, it's one hit. God. I can't do anything. What? I'm still alive, sir. Just the gameplay. I get that. It's definitely clunky. Or, well, even if it's not that. I definitely understand that. Oh, sh damn it. Ooh, that's actually a really good spot. Good call for whoever just put that there. Grenade right in the window. Or in the door.
Holy crap, dude. Oh my god. What than that one? <laughs> Regen, regen. He's the only one left. Dude's got 10 kills though. Put it on the gram and TikTok. <laughs> I have a bunch of stuff on the on TikTok still. Damn, dude. Seems like the appropriate time to say oh, shit. <laughs> Jumping out a window and blowing up a house, true. What is that? Sir. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Oh my God. Holy crap, I just got four kills. before that guy came through. Damn. He got a headshot right on me. Sounds good, Dev. 
Thanks for uh, chilling and chatting, man. It's good seeing you. Oh God. Oh my God. Dude, this guy is unstoppable. I want to know what he's at on his team. It's not even number one. Enjoy that. <laughs> All they need is one grenade in here, and we are done. That last part was pretty wild. Ooh, number one. Not bad. Total score, squads, lost nine. Zone captures 5.5, geez. Defense, assist kills, kills. Huh. Not bad. Higher run speed, don't mind if I do. Ooh, I really like that med pack usage. Med pack usage on anybody is really good in my opinion. Achieve top one in battle, nice. We got another trooper too. Got that done. 20 enemies with a pistol. Flamethrower, halfway to five. I can probably wait on getting any new people. M1 Grand. Almost there. That one's going to be nice too. Upgrades. Right. I think we're good. D-Day invasion. Oh boy. Here we go. Oh, I meant to go. <laughs> oh, damn. I was going to go plane or something. But... Let's 
swap to this guy. make one of these just so we have at least something that gets a little bit closer I should have just came into this thing God, dude. Got him, though. Gun down there. Is there a guy in there? There was. Oh my god. I feel like my AI are getting better. I don't know by how much, but. Damn. Oof. That guy is just wiping everybody out. Let's all use my sniper here. I kind of wish I did have one engineer in each squad. Because making that rally point is like night and day.
We absolutely need a closer rally point. Don't see this game on the PS store, really? Oh, uh, it might be PS5 only. I think it's Xbox Series S and Xbox One or Xbox, uh, the other one and then PS5. Wait, we don't, we don't have enough of those or we, we reached the limit. coming really dude we have the maximum amount i'm gonna try this well, i actually got one kill Comedy show popped up. Oh, that's my job. What? Headshot? Oh my god.
wonder if you can flip. Eject! Eject! Damn. <laughs> that was pretty sick. That was actually a good run. Actually a good run. Not great, but better than any other ones I've had so far. Jeez. I love how he spawned and they instantly start attacking. What is that? The one guy has a... Uh, what is that? He, oh, he had like a medic icon next to him. That'd be cool if there was a... I, that's one thing I wish this game did have was at least like one medic skill or ability. Not just like a med kit, but like a revive. spinning <laughs> oh my god
After this match, I'm gonna take a quick break and then we'll play some more. Oof. Oof. Hold on, Kiara. I'm in the middle of war. Oh, folks. Alright. Oh, why do you go crazy? You hot or is it just me? Go for it again. So we start at about <laughs> Kiara. Why she's crying as if she's getting hurt. Okay. Time to veer. Oh god. Oh god. What is going on? Yo, what's going on, Silver Knight? How you doing? back up to about 700 800 or so Yeah, 
I'm confused. I'm pulling back, but it's not going back. Why am I declining? Ugh. I think that was because they hit me or something, but whatever. It's kind of a close game. This will help a lot. Push, push, we need to get there, we need to get there. No. Oh, but this is an engineer right here. See me yet. Oh. 
Holy crap! <laughs> oh my god, dude. No respawns left. Capture the point to avoid defeat. Crap, we might have this. Wow. Oh my god, dude. Close one. Nice. Very nice. take that I'll take that one Was pretty good back there take that this explains why some of my guys were taking forever to uh upgrade or level up because the other ones uh you have to do their specific trees to level the snipers up faster No, I didn't mean to do that. <sighs> Crap. Oh, well. That's annoying. I did not mean to click on that, but I did. Grenade pouch. Grenades, explosives. This uses two of them. Uh... Hold off on it for now. I'm gonna get rid of this because I feel like I'm not gonna do that. 10 en enemies with hand grenades, that's doable. That one's almost here, so I'll leave that. Um, 